From generation to generation, the Mannheim Township family has been a close-knit group, and the significance of wearing one number on the football field is the ultimate badge of honor. Fox 43's Evan Brooks has more on the significance. I don't think he would have expected this. I think he would be very honored to know that this is the way his, his life is being carried on. A great teammate and even better person are just some of the phrases to describe Blue Streak's legend Steve Herman, a three-sport athlete whose number two football jersey was retired after he passed away in his sleep due to Wolf Parkinson's White Syndrome in 1993. His legacy, though, is far from forgotten. It's the best way to carry on his legacy, is have it be noticed out here on the field. What used to be just an award is now so much more. For just the second season, the number two jersey will be worn. This year's honor is bestowed upon senior wide receiver Nick Palumbo, a player head coach Mark Evans feels embodies everything Steve Herman stood for. Just kind of a lunch pail in their locker, go to work, uh, strong in the classroom, do whatever you need them to do on the football field to the best of their ability, and that's all you can ask for. And I can't imagine that uh, was probably the way Steve was too. Herman's time at Mannheim Township included a first-team all-conference honor. It's a high bar to live up to, but one Palumbo is excited to represent at the highest level. I had to talk to Mr. Herman for a good five, ten minutes after the football game on Friday, and it was, it was really nice to hear about how he's still so involved in the community, and he's really interested as me, in me and as, as a person and all my future plans and what's going on this year. And I mean, it's nice to get to know such great people through living through their son and this number two jersey. It's more than just a number. The jersey serves as a reminder of what the Blue Street community stands for. It's really important to have more of a connection to who Steve was. And, and that's when I approached the Hermans and asked for permission. Uh, we, we approached the alumni. Uh, again, I think it's important to keep his legacy and his name alive and, and add some more credibility to just getting an award at a banquet. Now you get to wear it all year long. And, and again, I think that brings a lot of glory and praise and honor to who Steve was. While Herman's legacy will continue to change hands, those who cherished him most will always have a reminder of what he stood for. It matters to us, the people that played here, that continue to follow the program, that it's extremely meaningful. And um, I know that next year's group for our 30th reunion will look forward to seeing who the next player is. Evan Brooks, Fox 43.